I just want to let you know, January 31st, we're going to be doing a brand new iPhone XS Max giveaway on a live stream on January 31st at 8, at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here in the United States. You can enter anywhere in the country. All you got to do is be here 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. And if you're a random commenter on my live stream, you have a really good chance of winning a brand new iPhone XS Max. You must be here January 31st at 8 o'clock p.m. to enter. Yeah, this week we emptied out pretty good. Almost all this row, this entire row, half this row, half this row, half this row, and almost all this row. So very good week. So we should have a lot of money in here, but before we take the money out, we gotta fill it. All right guys, so let's get right into this video. Also guys, here's all the money that I pulled from my vending machines today. It might not look as much as it was on the thumbnail just because I have it all rubber banded up right now. Take a guess how much money you think is here. If you watch till the end of the video, I actually show all this money on rubber banded. Tell me how much money you think is here down in the comments down below. And if you guess that answer correctly, you will win all this money right here. I'll send it straight to you. This is all the money I pulled from my candy machine today. I show how much more is here later on in the video. It shows a little bit better of a view. All you guys gotta do is comment down below how much you think my vending machine made. And if you guess it correctly, I'll send you all the money through PayPal or a gift card or something. We do this on the channel all the time. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, like the video, subscribe and stay tuned. All you guys got to do is guess down below, like the video, and press the subscribe button for me. And if you want, turn on those push bell notifications. It'd be very much appreciated. Thank you guys so much for all the support on the channel lately. Now let's get right into this video. What's going on guys, Aaron Hips here, and today I have another video of me going and servicing some machines on my route. Today, we are gonna go pull cash from my candy machine on location. If you guys remember, I did this with my pop machine, and I gave away all the money on my YouTube channel to one of you lucky winners that guessed the right answer down below. All you guys gotta do is guess how much money you think my candy machine is gonna make in this video. I'm gonna show how much money is gonna be in there. I'm gonna like roll it all out on the table for you. I'm not gonna count it, but then you guys gotta take a guess. Whoever guesses the right answer down below is gonna win all the cash. But before we go to my vending machine, I have a couple stops I gotta do first. Right now, I'm at the arcade. My truck too guys it is so it's not even it's I mean it's kind of nasty but it's like it's just more disorganized than anything when you're a vendor and you have handfuls and handfuls of locations in our cage oh my god you can see the claw machine in the roof we made that looks so funny get caught up and really busy and cleaning a truck of yours is kind of becomes on the bottom of the list okay where am I driving I'm driving in a circle Hey, over here. Okay, okay. Back here, like, I don't know if you can see it, but you can see the mirror. You can see the mirror in the back of this. There's a machine right here. Um, this one's actually broken. This one's just used for parts. Alright guys, so we are now at the place where I buy all my stock for my vending machines, like the pop, the candy, and stuff like that. Um, I might film some on my phone. I don't want to take my phone in, or <laughs> I don't want to take my camera in. Anyways, I don't want to take my big old camera in. Look at it. I don't want to take this in there. And so what I think I might do is just film some on my phone. It's really cool because here you don't have to buy like boxes of candy. When I say like boxes of candy, I mean like you don't have to buy like 50 bags of chips of one certain kind if you don't want to. I can literally buy like six or seven bags of chips of like Doritos or if I only want one bags of like one bag of like Funyuns or something, I can pick one bag individually. I'll film some on my phone so you guys can see how it goes. So the quality might drop a little bit just because I'm on my phone. I'm just, there, there's pop and everything in there too. So let's go in and check it out and then we're gonna go and uh, take the money out of that candy machine. How you doing? Good, I just talked to you on the phone earlier. I'm just here to pick yeah, up product so. pop and stuff like that, so thank you. Hi, what's up, buddy? Hi. Hi. 
I was just on the phone with a guy, so I didn't really film me grabbing pop. I got to get some Dr. Pepper over there. Um, got one case of Mountain Dew. This is all the pop I go through in my vending machine or this for this location in about one week because uh, this is my only vending account. Comment down below if you guys think I should get more vending accounts. It's really cool because you can individually pick out your stuff so I can like, open these little bags and grab like one or two of these if I only want one or two hundred grand or uh, whatever so it's really cool so I'm gonna start picking out some stuff and uh, I'll get back with you. Gotta get organized to fit all this product in here. In the vending machine that I have, and so uh, they wanted Dr. Pepper in the Coke machine. <laughs> they wanted Dr. Pepper in the machine that I have there, and so I'm gonna change one of the selections over to Dr. Pepper. like 130 140 bucks for all this really not that bad I always thought like even if you didn't run vending machines on location it might be a smart idea just to come here for your house all right so we're at the vending account now guys got to open these uh, little lock things up like that all right we're gonna take these in first yeah, this week we emptied out pretty good. Almost all this row, this entire row, half this row, half this row, half this row, and almost all this row. So very good week. So we should have a lot of money in here, but before we take the money out, we gotta fill it. So we didn't sell as much Mountain Dew as I thought. I only went through like a quarter of a row, so I barely had to use any. So I really didn't need to buy any, but I'm sure next week um, I'll be able to use the rest of them. All these are empty. Is <clears throat> It's a little ghetto. But I wrote Coca-Cola, there's two Cokes. There's one Coke and there's two. This is Coca-Cola Classic. And uh, I don't know. So were you gonna use one of these for Dr. Pepper? So I'm just gonna write Dr. Pepper on it, just on the main thing with like a Sharpie. All right, so we got Dr. Pepper on there, 20 ounces. And we uh, redid the Coke one on there. Not the best looking, but it gets the job done. Now we gotta come over here, uh, gotta fill the candy machine up. Snickers do really good here, so we uh, got about 10 of them to put in here. I got two of these. These are the Twix. These are the ones with peanut butter in them. Gonna try it out, see how they work. These ones, and these do usually pretty good. So I bought one of them. We're actually gonna take this, put this Starburst up in here. And then there. So what I'll do is I'll put a Flavors Reds in front, and then I'll put the normal one in the back. So if you really want the original one, you have to buy this one, then buy that one. It's kind of mean, but it gets the job done. All right, guys, so we got the whole thing filled up. Some of them are double. I have double of these. I think that's the only double I have. Oh, double, double, double. So now we're going to take the money out. Let's do this right now. All right, guys, so this is just the dollars. Um, so this is going to be for about one week. Let's see what we did. Hey, not that bad. <clears throat> Squeeze. Urgh. Sometimes they're kind of hard to get out when they're this full. If you guys saw my uh, Coke machine video, 
when I pulled the money from that thing, there was about a full stack. So there's a little more than this. So if you guys go to the other video and watch that, take your guess off of how much is here. Cause the other one was 444. And that was a bigger stack than this. So it's obviously gonna be less than 444. Keep in mind, this machine also takes $5 bills. So take your guess down below guys, right now, and let's wrap up this machine. I'm gonna grab a snack for the road, so I'm gonna test this out anyways. <laughs> Alrighty. Mmm. A white Reese cup seems good. 45. 45. Let's see it. A. Hey. 10 cents. Let's uh, grab a drink. All right guys, if you guys like this video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys guess down below how much money. I'll be picking a winner in about a week or so. If you guess the number correctly on how much money is in that snack machine, in that stack of cash, I will send all the money to the winner that guesses it correctly. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you smash that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys later.